22 most beautiful places in the world. If you're an avid traveler, you probably have a bucket list as long as your arm. And today you're going to be adding to that ever-growing list. We're booking a one-way ticket to some of the most beautiful places in the world. So make sure that your passport is ready. 22. Sosa's Flay, Namibia Namibia is just an exquisite place overall, from natural springs to deserts, beaches, salt flats and much more. And here's another spot you don't want to miss when you head to this little African country, Sosa's Flay. It's located in the Namib Naukluft National Park and is a salt and clay pan surrounded by massive sand dunes. The pans are dry most of the time, but there are rare times when the rain falls and it creates the most incredible, surreal sight you'll ever see. The red dunes that surrounds the flats get reflected in the water left behind from the rains and it's an image that is hard to forget. 21. Sailor Landsfors, Iceland If hot, arid conditions are not your thing, then head to Sailor Landsfors, Iceland, a waterfall that will leave you breathless. One of the most well-known waterfalls in Iceland, it is 65 meters or 213 feet tall and if you're lucky, on a sunny day you'll capture an image of the rainbow reflecting off the fall. Just remember to pack a raincoat because you're definitely going to get drenched. 20. Hallstatt, Austria This picture-perfect town is known as the most photographed place in Europe and it's easy to see why. This little town is known for its production of salt, so a visit there must include a stop at the ancient salt mine. If salt is not your thing, then definitely consider a trip to the Glacier Garden or taking a stroll through the 16th century Alpine houses. It's also been declared a World Heritage Site since 1997. 19. Moraine Lake, Canada Over in the Canadian Rockies, in the remote valley of the Ten Peaks, is this magical lake called Moraine Lake. It's a small glacier-fed lake surrounded by exquisite waterfalls, mountains and rocks and viewing it will leave you breathless. The color of the lake is never the same and as the glaciers melt into the lake and the water rises, so the color changes. Photographs will never do this spot justice and it's something you need to see in reality to truly appreciate. 18. Okavango Delta, Botswana Botswana is another spot that is too magical to put into words. It's a place that you will easily see a herd of elephants cross your path as you're driving down the road. The Okavango Delta is fed by the Zambezi River and is home to every animal imaginable. Rhino, zebra, elephant, giraffe, buffalo, cheetah, lions and hippos. The best way to soak in all the beauty is in a dugout canoe with a reputable guide. Just remember to watch out for the crocs. 17. Lake Bled, Slovenia You'd be forgiven for thinking that this comes straight from a Disney movie, as it's just so beautiful. But it's a real spot you can visit in Slovenia. It's a bright green lake with a tiny island in the middle. The island is home to a small church and an ancient medieval castle and lots of luscious greenery. Thinking of proposing to someone? Then this would be the perfect spot. 16. Torre del Paine National Park, Chile Patagonia is always a winner and this protected land offers you everything from mountains, glaciers, forests and lakes. Try and head there during their summer as the sun doesn't set until after 10 p.m. So you'd be able to spend a lot more time just soaking in the intense color and beauty of the place. 15. Blue Lagoon, Iceland Located between Reykjavik and Keflavik International Airport is the Blue Lagoon. This rare geothermal spa boasts these unusual milky white waters. It's not a natural lagoon and the water comes from the Swatsengi, a geothermal power plant close by. Before the water reaches the lagoon, it has a few functions it has to serve. The heated water is channeled underground close to a lava flow and it powers the turbines and generates electricity. Once that's completed, the hot water and steam go through a heat exchanger and provides hot water for a city. Only once that is done does the water head to the lagoon for recreational purposes. The water is rich in minerals, silica and sulfur and many believe that bathing in the lagoon provides the skin with loads of benefits. 14. Kuchenhof Gardens, Netherlands Every year at springtime, roughly 7 million tulip bulbs, daffodils and hyacinths blossom at the same time. The spectacle only lasts three months, from March to May, so you need to plan your trip carefully. The gardens date back to the 15th century when simple fruit and veg were grown for the kitchen of Tellingen Castle. The gardens were redesigned in 1857 by Jan David Zoker and his son Louis Paul Zoker. The idea to convert it into a spring flowering bulb garden was introduced in 1949 and the park officially opened in 1950. 
In that first year, 236,000 people came to visit. 13. Changjiaqi National Forest, China If you've watched Avatar, you might find there are similarities between that movie and this national forest. That's because this park was used as a model for that blockbuster movie. The park is made up of 243 peaks and 3,000-plus cast pinnacles. This area has the highest concentration of quartzite sandstone formations in the world, and with the right angle of sunlight and mist in the early morning, it is said to be otherworldly. 12. Mu Can Chai, Vietnam A site that will be very difficult to remove from your memory is Mu Can Chai in Vietnam. It will feel like you've stepped into a fairy tale as you're surrounded by rice paddy terraced mountains and gentle streams. This is a popular spot for tourists and translated, Mu or Mo means forests of wood in the local language. Kang means dry and Chai means earth. The rice fields span over 2,200 hectares and the reason why they're terraced like this was to be able to retain the water from the mountains and the streams in order to grow their rice. 11. Sidi Bo Said, Tunisia not so much off the beaten track is Sidi Bao Said, Tunisia. This small Mediterranean village will have your eyes soaking in as much as possible when you're faced with the exquisite shades of blue and white with local artwork on display everywhere you go. The town used to be called Jabal al Minar and was renamed after a religious figure who used to live there. This man arrived in the village in the late 12th century and established a sanctuary. 10. Douro Valley, Portugal if wine is more your cup of tea, then head on over to Douro Valley in Portugal, where you'll be spoiled with hundreds of vineyards producing primarily a port that has been produced in the region for over 2,000 years, and some equally decent red and white wines. Some of the most famous port producers of the region include the Cockburns, Taylors and Sandyman. The landscape is made up of steep terraces covered with vines and farms, also known as quintas. You can often spend a night at one of these quintas and indulge in local chorizo, which is a type of sausage, or presinto, a smoked ham. And then, wash it all down with a few glasses of port, of course. 9. Bagan, Myanmar Classed as the trip of a lifetime, this ancient city in Myanmar is filled with thousands of Buddhist temples and pagodas. For the best views, it is highly recommended that you take a hot balloon ride over the area. Bagan is one of the world's most incredible archaeological sites and was built between 1057 and 1287. Sadly, an earthquake and an invasion by the Mongols destroyed over 2,000 temples and only 2,230 remain today. It is a protected area by UNESCO and at this stage, it's not overcrowded with tourists. So, visiting is certainly something to consider if you don't like massive crowds. 8. Faroe Islands, Norway not many people know of Faroe Islands, and like our previous post, if you're not into crowds and queuing, then head here. It's located between Iceland and Norway and is a collection of 18 treeless islands connected by causeways and road tunnels. It's a spot where you'll fish, a lot, enjoy some boating and completely break away from everything you're used to. Craggy cliffs, meadows, colorful cottages and churches are all there, sometimes hidden from view because of the rolling clouds in the area. 7. Cliffs of Moho, Island it's a shot that is often captured to perfection, and often being the operative word. The cliffs of Moho are one of the main reasons tourists head to Ireland, and more than 1.5 million people head there every year. The site is also used often in pop culture, for example, Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets and The Princess Bride. It's also been featured in a few music videos, including Maroon 5's Runaway and Westlife's My Love. 6. 12 Apostles, Australia Admittedly, there are only eight of these limestone rock formations standing, but their name remains the same. Erosion and the rough seas are playing havoc with these spectacular pillars, and sadly, it's only a matter of time before there will be none remaining. It will take you about four hours to drive there from Melbourne. 5. Sheikh Zayed Grand Mosque, Abu Dhabi, UAE There's always an opening on a trip to head to a mosque, and if you find yourself in Abu Dhabi, then the Sheikh Zayed Grand Mosque is a must-see. This building is spread over 12 hectares and features 82 domes able to accommodate up to 40,000 worshippers. Besides the large size of the mosque, it's truly one of the most beautiful. The marble courtyard is stunning with its mosaic flowers native to the Middle East. Both Rihanna and Selena Gomez received criticism for their inappropriate shots of the mosque. Gomez showed her ankle with the mosque behind her, and Rihanna was said to have posed inappropriately and asked to leave. 4. Provence, France you can pose however you like in Provence, France, if you don't mind the overpowering scent of lavender in their beautiful lavender fields. 
Provence has so much to offer an avid traveler, not just never-ending lavender fields, but ensure that you put the lavender fields top of your list when you head there, because their beauty is overwhelming. 3. Arashiyama Bamboo Forest, Japan Kyoto on the whole is just an incredible place to visit. It used to be the former imperial capital of Japan for a thousand years. Just on the outskirts is the bamboo forest, with plants that tower over you and creak and sway in the wind. Indulge me and take a second to imagine you're standing there, hand in hand with someone you love. Hard to beat, right? Said to be one of the most photographed places in Japan, the Arashiyama Bamboo Forest is one to add to your ever-growing bucket list. 2. Socotra Yemen if you had to tell someone you're traveling to see a few trees, they may think you're a little nuts. But when they see the trees you're seeing, they'll want to join you. This area has been called the most alien-looking place on Earth, and that's because these dragon's blood trees are just so unusual looking. You'll need to head to the small archipelago in the Arabian Sea to view the trees, and make sure you pack extra batteries, as you won't be able to deal with your camera losing power after all the photos you'll definitely be taking. Have you been fortunate enough to visit any of these incredibly beautiful places? If so, tell us which one and share your experience with us in the comments below. 1. Ronda, Spain On top of Altajo Gorge is this Andalusian city that was first established by the early Celts round about the 6th century AD. The Galdelivan River flows through the city and the reason why you're there is to grab a photograph of the amazing bridge that connects the 15th century new town to the much older old town. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button down here and subscribe over here.